Commander Pritch at your service, my lord. Lord Barris informed me you'd be paying us a visit. I'm prepared to offer full assistance. News travels fast. Lord Barris is nothing if not efficient. Let me follow his lead and bring you up to speed. There's been much unrest in these parts recently, my lord. Capped off by a violent slave revolt that has the surrounding jungles overrun with armed slaves. Armed slaves? How daunting. They've proven to be more tenacious than you would expect, my lord. What no one knows is that Lord Barris orchestrated the insurgents to disrupt one of his rivals, and he wants his involvement kept secret. Now the slave captains who led the revolt are threatening to expose Barris's involvement unless they receive more potent weapons. Slaves. They're never satisfied. I'd just be happy if you took the stupid shock collar off. But then I couldn't do this. Ah! Oh! Oh! Fine! Forget I mentioned it! I see you know how to handle slaves, my lord. You think they know better than to blackmail a Sith Lord. Lord Barris wants you to kill enough of the blackmailing slave captains to make the others lose their resolve. I'll kill every one I see. Present company excluded. I hope. If you're lucky. Slaves are scattered throughout the area, but the captains tend to congregate near the unfinished Colossus. I'll wait here for your return. It takes guts to sit here and wait, don't you think? Take it up with the commander. I'm sure he'd appreciate the constructive criticism. Nah, I think I'll let him live in shame. Hey, uh, my lord, right? Not sure about my propers with you folks. Seeing as how you're already killing slaves and causing a fuss, how'd you like to make a pile of credits? Can't have too many credits. That's what I like to hear. Let me give you the lowdown. So Darth Valron is on the Dark Council, and his apprentice Lord Ket wants to advance, so he starts building a giant statue to his master. But Lord Ket doesn't want his master to know, so he brings in slaves from off-world. Slaves rebel, and we get this mess. Buy cheap slaves and get a rebellion. Everyone knows that. Here's where it gets complicated. Lord Ket wants to save face, but secretly. He calls in me and my mercs. By the time we get here, the slaves have captured some giant industrial drills and they're getting ready to bring down the whole giant statue. Our best team goes in with explosives to blow up the drills. Slaves kill every last one. Got a pile of credits for anyone who grabs those explosives. Hooks them to a giant drill, then fights off slaves until the explosives detonate. My lord? Look at them out there. They're like animals. Hundreds of slaves with no one to command them and without a thought in their minds as to what to do with their freedom. Like I said, the slaves are animals. But we've noticed strange behavior in the pack. And my superiors want to know more. Some of the slaves are killing each other. We don't know if they're mad or hungry, desperate, or if there's a faction of slaves who've turned on the rest. I can see how a slave civil war would prove useful. Exactly what the higher-ups are saying. That the killers could potentially be manipulated. We know that the killings are ritualistic. The murderous slaves come in the night, stab their foes and paint themselves in blood. If you could investigate, catch them in the act and take them down, maybe you could find a clue to their motives. The slaves will give up their knowledge to me. Look for any slave who's turned on his peers. With luck, he'll lead us to answers. Just when you thought there weren't enough big statues on this planet.
You. You are not the initiate. You. You are Sith. You honor us with your presence, mighty lord. Welcome to our prison. What sort of a freak of a slave are you? I am Traka Unvor, leader of the Unchained. I am master of my hatred. When the other slaves broke free, I laughed. Like you, I knew their escape was a delusion. For only Sith possess true freedom. Some elaboration is required. I know the Sith Code. Freedom comes through power, through victory. I saw a chance to prove myself. I culled weak from strong. I began to kill and to teach. I showed slaves freedom through bloodshed. Now my followers and I are the masters here. And soon, we will become Sith ourselves. You may have potential, but are you strong in the Force? My strength is in my fists, but the Force has guided me here, and it has guided you. Now you can spread word of us to the Empire. Your strength is great. With your approval, we shall serve. Carry our message of allegiance to your masters, and we will become the new face of the Empire. We will be champions of the dark side. The Empire will hear your message. As it should be. Take this data pad, my plea to the Sith Lords. For now, I am not ready to leave the Colossus. With every kill, I feel my power grow. And there are many slaves who may yet join me. But soon, we will all be ready. We will await word from the Empire. For now, continue your work. Kill the slaves in my name. Farewell for now. We return to the shadows. Talk later. Promise. Good to see you back. I knew those slaves couldn't hold their own against you. I take it you managed to track down one of the murderers. What's their story? Can we use them? The killers will now serve the Empire. I have their oath of allegiance here. What do you mean? Let me see that data pad. This is madness. They're serious. Slaves who think they can become Sith. 
You've got a weak stomach, Ensign. Apologies. I just... No. You're right, of course. I'll inform command. I'm not... I'm not actually authorized to speak with Sith Lords on the blockade. But I'll make sure they know, too. It's been an honor working with you. I hope we meet again. That was a fantastic show. That drill just lit up the night. Here's the credits, as promised. Ah, my lord, you've returned. I take it many slave captains have died this day. Their next of kin won't be able to identify them. I shudder to imagine their fate. I must stay, my lord. It's been inspiring watching you work. Prostrate yourself elsewhere, Imperial. I'm sorry if I've angered you. I'll inform Lord Barris that the situation has been handled. I don't care what you do. Break my bones, burn my flesh. I'll tell you nothing. I will not be denied. Go spit, you monster! I didn't know I was going to end like that. I think I'm going to be sick. Don't empty your stomach on my boots. Ah, apprentice, you've returned. Commander Pritch confirmed that the slaves have been silenced. Good. I'm still trying to extract the information I crave from this Republic agent. He is much more resilient than anticipated. He'll crack, Master. I'm sure of it. I will not rest until he does. I have another important task for you. It involves a renegade Sith Lord named Grathen. A particularly bothersome thorn in my side. Meet with my apprentice, Dracul Ball. He's my covert operative in Gratham's compound. Ball claims to have made a key discovery. I thought I might be your only apprentice. That makes Baal my rival. Try to tolerate him long enough to get the details and conclude your business there. Gratham's presence is useful to me, so I don't want him killed, just crippled. Find out what Ball has discovered, and do exactly as he instructs. Is your other apprentice above me in the pecking order? I'm sure he views himself as your better. But he has merely been here longer. Now oh, then, Republic wretch, where were we? Oh, yes. <laughs> Already you move through the citadel as if it were yours. Perhaps someday it will be. I am the apprentice and voice of Darth Charnas. I speak in his name and I would bargain for your services. If your master needs me, he can come to me himself. My master prefers to remain in the shadows, but do not doubt his power, nor his ability to reward success. I speak for him. I require individuals capable of gaining prestige in a society weaned on secrecy and madness. Individuals who can earn respect, if not love. I need infiltrators to eliminate an enemy of the Sith. You would serve well. All enemies of the Sith will die before me. Our enemy is the Order of Revan. A cult of fools hidden at every stratum of Imperial society. For years, the Revanite heretics have secretly recruited military officers, powerful Sith, wealthy mercenaries, anyone who can add to their power. 